Hello everyone, I'm Dr. Aisha Ansari from Mumbai. Uh, I'm going to talk to you regarding the IUI uh, methods of preparation of the IUI sample. Today we are going to focus on the two main preparation techniques. One is the swim up technique and other is the double density gradient method. So whenever we get a semen sample uh, for IUI, for the swim up technique, we take about 3 ml of the semen sample in this conical tube and layer it with 5 ml of HDF media. Now this is kept aside for approximately 45 minutes in an incubator at 37 degrees Celsius and preferably in a tilted position at a 45 degrees tilt. Through this, the sperms get activated and they swim up towards the upper layers. Now, after this 45 minutes, we remove approximately 75% of the supernatant and take it another conical tube. We centrifuge it at about 1500 RPM for 10 to 15 minutes. Then, a pellet is formed lower down. The whole supernatant is removed. This pellet is super layered with another 1 ml of HDF media and then the sample is ready for an IUI process. Before proceeding with IUI, again do a post wash analysis to see the results. The next technique is the double density gradient method. Again, after collection of the semen sample, about 1 ml, so first here a 90% media is taken. This is a 90% media. First we put in the 90% media. Then we take the 45% and over it very gradually through the sides of the conical tube we layer about 1 ml of the semen sample. Now this is centrifuged at 1500 rpm for 15 minutes. After the centrifugation a small pellet is formed lower down. Above the whole supernatant is completely taken off and then this pellet is super layered with about 1.5 ml of HDF media. Again, we do a centrifugation of 1200 RPM for about 10 minutes. After centrifugation, an, another pellet is formed. The supernatant is removed. Another 1 ml of HDF media is added. And post which it is kept aside for about 15 to 20 minutes in an incubator. And then the sample is ready to use for IUI. So these are the two methods. The double density gradient method is usually used in patients with oligospermia and swim up techniques can be used when the semen sample has a normal count. Thank you.